Hello people, I'm the Real Comic Book Gamer, and a lot of people have been asking me to talk about Injustice 2, haven't talked about it much lately, but we just got this trailer showing off Harley Quinn and Deadshot, they're now confirmed for Injustice 2, no surprise there really, like we knew 100% Harley Quinn was going to be in this game, and I was pretty sure Deadshot was going to be in it as well, because he was in Suicide Squad, and he's one of the popular characters, and well he's been gaining popularity over the years, and a lot of people loved him in, in Suicide Squad, so pretty sure he was going to be in the game, no surprise really with these confirmations, but it is pretty cool to see these characters in it. Uh... The moves look cool. A lot of uh, reused animations for Harley Quinn, like we've seen with a lot of characters that were in the previous game that are in this game. A lot of reused animations. Her super looks pretty cool. I like that they're incorporating the hyenas in it. I think that's uh, that could be interesting, and her super does look very cool. Uh, her costume, I'm not a fan of any of the designs shown in this trailer. You know, the big gimmick with this is, hey, we got new costumes that'll change how you play and also look different. And I didn't care for any of Harley Quinn's designs. The first one looked like if the CW made a Harley Quinn, that's how it'd be, considering the CW is obsessed with leather. That's what that one looks like. The second one just looks very generic, like sexy outfit. That's what it is to me. And then the third one looks sort of like a Harley Quinn Mad Max porno type deal it really looks weird because she's got her classic uh her, her classic sort of like headdress on and then the like neck down it's just really weird mad max porno type stuff going on it just it, it looks it looks bad it really does look like if someone made a harley quinn mad max porno that would be the the costume they'd use and then deadshot comes in deadshot looks really cool in terms of how he's gonna play he looks very similar to Deathstroke in terms of how he plays, so I really hope Nethero doesn't decide, hey, you know, no reason to include Deathstroke since we got Deadshot in here. They play basically the same, so let's just not include him. I hope they don't do that because Deathstroke is one of my favorite characters in all of comics, and I love playing as him in Injustice 1, so I really hope he is in this game, and it would be a shame if he is not included. But yeah, Deadshot Super looks awesome. It really looks badass. It looks really flashy and cool and just overall awesome awesome what he does it looks uh, man it looks amazing one of my favorites that i've seen out of the new characters that we've gotten in this game just yeah the super looks really cool deadshot's design however not so much he's very generic assassin man looking he looks very like hey here's a generic mercenary guy there you go he's that there's basically nothing distinguishing him from just your generic assassin army man but he's got the little scope symbol thingy on his chest and the thing on his eye. That's all you need to know that it's Deadshot. No, no, you need a little more than that. Like, if you were to show me this picture with no context, I would have a bit of a hard time guessing it's Deadshot. I'd get there eventually because you can tell. But barely, there's not a whole lot distinguishing him. He looks very generic. And he, to me, he looks a lot like an Arkham Knight militia thug. Like, seriously, just just look at this. There it is, everything. <laughs> you can't tell me he doesn't look like he fits in perfectly with the Arkham Knight militia. He's just covered in red. He's got the little bit of white to be like, hey, look, look, he's dead shot. He's got the white on his mask a little bit. He looks just like that. Yeah. No, not really. He's just not a fan of the design. But as far as gameplay goes, he looks pretty cool. Him and Atrocitus are the two characters that I'm most excited to play as out of the new characters for Injustice 2. His super move looks awesome, and, I'm really, and I really like the way his playstyle looks. And he just overall looks pretty cool besides the design. Also, uh, Tara Strong is back as Harley Quinn. She's not my favorite choice as Harley Quinn. She's not bad, but she's not really good either to be kind of get anyone I know a lot of people like her as Harley Quinn but I'm still kind of stuck on the original voice actress I'm not a fan of just to me Tara Strong's Harley Quinn kind of gets worse and worse every time it just it seems really whiny to me like really high-pitched and whiny and just, just gets worse every time to me not nothing against Tara Strong I think she's a, she is a great voice actress I love her as Barbara Gordon but not a fan of her Harley Quinn again not a bad Harley Quinn just not a really good Harley Quinn either. Anyways, please let me know in the comments below what you think of this trailer. Do you think it's really cool? Who are you more excited to play as uh, Harley Quinn or Deadshot? I'd imagine more people would be excited to play as Deadshot concerning Harley Quinn. We already play as her in Justice 1. It looks like she's really basically the same with a few new little things sprinkled here and there just like they're doing with the other characters. At least that's how it seemed. But yeah, please let me know in the comments below what you think of the gameplay, the trailer, and the designs. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video and see you guys in the next one. I've been so alone ever since I left the tribe That's just how it goes, cause I like the lonely vibe But they'll never know, cause I'm always on my grind And I live a lonely life, and I'm never getting stressed Cause I gotta stay